here we go. We're standing here at the aquaponics, and I'm just going to talk about a few things. I moved some stuff around, not much. This right here, I used to just let it float around, but the reality is that the, the goldfish just eat the roots off everything. And this is mint growing in there. And then you can see this is a water lily that came from the pond behind us. And then this is all uh, Japanese water spinach in it. It is out of control. I've got vines out here that are eight, 10 feet long. And then I'm trying, I got a little aquarium over there. I'm gonna hook a small pump up to it and I'm gonna try to grow uh, plants in there. Cause when I had it in my garage, if you saw some of my videos from the winter, stuff went crazy in there. I had, you know, little minnows in there and I, I had that hooked up just as a, as an actual aquarium in the garage. And I, I, I started so many plants and it was amazing. So I'm gonna try that again this year. I'm gonna try it out here first. And if I build a greenhouse, I'll put it in there. And then I actually have real water plants, like these different water lilies, um, elephant ears. These, I've got them growing all over. I need to do something different with them. I've got to go plant them. And this is the first time I've seen one of these guys actually flower like that. So that's pretty cool. But it's just, it's just keep going. And then these roots on these, on these elephant ears, some of these roots are about eight feet long. They go down underneath there. They'll eventually come up. I've got some more elephant ears down there. I just need to start getting them around my yard. The only problem is, is in the backyard here, I got to find like north side of something here, um, out by the yard and all that stuff after it rains, when I got more water, I can do, I can plant them out there. But right now it's just, if I put them anywhere else, they'll just die because it's just been dry. It's been so dry here in, you know, Northwest Florida. So anyways, just a quick update on this. And the goldfish are kicking butt. I've caught three little brown water snakes in here and take them across the street, put them in the bayou. I got a bunch of minnows in here right now with them uh there's a couple brim left most of those have died when i lost power for like 12 hours and uh so did the big catfish i had and my big koi so I'll, eventually we'll get some more fish but the, the goldfish i don't know if you see any in there yeah see they're doing great they're huge they're happy and grandkids and kids love them so all right that's it you guys take care